the kids are just beating each other in the stroller. Whoever's in that front seat is just getting walloped by the person behind them. And we've switched seats, so it's not just one kid doing it. Oh, parents, I see you. I feel your pain. Kids will be kids even in the most magical place on earth. <laughs> I hear man cub just screaming. My camera is also dead, so it's currently attached to my power bank. <laughs> Again, that's how this day's going. It is day six. We're all just a little bit tired, and I think we've pushed a little too hard some days. Although we slept in today, we didn't get to Ep Epcot until after 11. Mickey's on the planet. She's laying down. That seat's soaking wet because he spilled bubble juice all over it. <laughs> so now he's walking. The good news is this is absolutely gorgeous. This makes my heart happy. Look at how cute that is. She's just squawking like a chicken. So I think the game plan, I have a DAS for Mickey and Minnie's. It's about an hour wait. So I think we're gonna attempt Muppets for the little bub. I think Man Cub liked that one a lot last time. So we're gonna do that for him. God, y'all, people have no sense of self-preservation. They literally just walk in front of strollers or they walk in front of you and stop. Get your shoe back on, please. like literally you'll be walking a straight line and people just shove in front of you. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Got my gin gin chew. For this one. Go bonk your head, Weez. Go bonk your head, bonk your head just carefully. I don't want to carefully bonk. Oh, she's, she's got go. a callus now from bonking all over. She's got calluses. High five. High five. Awesome. <laughs> all right. Enjoy yeah, your you're flight. you're taller than Weez, Bubba. Oh, no, you're taller than Master Yoda. I think you're even taller <laughs> Come on, dude. Than Ola. Come on. Bye, bud. <laughs> Follow your dad down. <laughs> Follow dad down. <laughs> Whoa. AT AT Walker. Yeah. Follow Dada. Da. It's saying this is the Star Wars ride. Come on, guys. <gasps> There's C3PO. There's BB-8. I mean, not BB-8. R2-D2. Muppet 3D Vision. This show, Man Cub Love, last year, it absolutely 
terrified. It terrified this one last year, so. <laughs> I think she's a little bit tougher this year. She did well with the Philhar Magic. So we'll see. It's kind of like the double duck show. We'll see how she does this year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's got his own name tag. I tried to put him on the ground in the bathroom with the like less than an inch mosaic tiles. He couldn't stand up. <laughs> <laughs> he lost his himself. I jumped up on my feet. Purple. We got purple glasses. Okay. Thank you, Bubba. All right, come on. <laughs> She's just gonna pop a squat. She's everybody else to Back to Mickey and Minnie's. Man Cub loved the Muppet Show like I knew he would. Because he loves he loves slapstick. Hollywood Studios at night is just a vibe, man. That one wasn't as good as the dollar. Yeah, he Philhar Magic is his jam in Magic Kingdom. That's baseline tap house. That little girl. She looks like she's wearing down. Struggling, but he's still doing the step on the crack thing. <laughs> All right, lightning lane. You gotta go first. Oh yeah. Good job, baby. Do you mind helping these good people in the yeah. park who want to fix this TV. here locomotive? Yeah. The TV would. Thanks! Be back in a jiffy! That's the smoke detector.
to play together. Oh. Now, let's I was one of those people that was butthurt they took out the great movie ride. But Mickey and Minnie's is really cute and I love the trackless like ride system. It's very fun. And the kids absolutely love it. Again, Man Cub loves slapstick humor. So Goofy throwing the pie in the train whistle and making this... Yeah, just kicking the whole thing off like that. Like, Man Cub is into it. Like, he just starts giggling and cackling and he's here for it. So, it's 7.20 now. We have our last dash for Tower at 7.50. So Hubby's gonna take the children on Millennium Falcon Smuggler's Run. It only has a 30 minute wait right now because I can't do that one. Like Star Tours, Star Tours about got me. He said he looked over at me at one point and I was just like breathing, like practicing deep breaths. And I was like, yeah, I was struggling for a minute. The ginger chew helped a lot. So I do recommend doing that if you get motion sickness. But like, there's no way I can do smugglers. The screen's gonna be more, and it's a smaller ship, so I'll be closer to it. Whew. I don't know, man. We'll see. I might attempt it. I do have another ginger candy. But yeah, look how pretty Star Wars, or being Toy Story, is at night. I just love it. I wish we had time to do Slinky Dog again, which technically we could if I did another Dash Pass after Tower, but. We're beat. We have a very early morning at Magic Kingdom. Early morning magic or early morning resort guest hours starts at 7.30 tomorrow. And I wanna get our castle pictures tomorrow. So I wanna be there for that. So we've got a very early morning. That sexy man. Oh, you heard I was talking about you? Oh. <laughs> he wants to know how many Star Wars rides there are, and I was like, well, he said, why is there another one? And I said, this is the good guy's one. Oh, why? <laughs> Did he I want have? the bad guy one? Let that that's not the stroller. She tossed that juice box aside real quick. You're finished? Hold on, let me get it. He wants to do it too. This one you do have to crack. I'm gonna have to help him crank it. Yeah. No, my son! Do you have the idea to help? They're, de they're getting it. You got it, kids. One, keep going, keep going, keep going. You want that? Let me get one hand on there. Careful. So these are $1 for one, or you can do $4 for all four coins. So basically, this it's a dollar piece. You don't get a discount for doing all of them. It's all of them. Is that all? Get them. Swirling saucers is the vibe. And then just like that, we're heading into bath two. I feel like these areas are less touristy and more like home theme. Yeah. In Hollywood. That's the thing I have about Hollywood. The yeah. Stuff's better. All right, Smugglers is by the Millennium Falcon, and I don't know which way that is. Just go around. <laughs> he 
actually wanted to go in a gift shop. I love the noises. Like I said, this is more on theme like you're walking through like I like that's a tie fighter. <laughs> no, it's not. What is it? That's uh Dark and Stormy's. You're yeah. right, there is a stormtrooper. He's gonna hear you. I mean, that just always looks really freaking cool. Park controller on that far wall. Hey, that's the lightning lane, babe. Shooting! You got it, guys! <laughs> 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 
Yes, yes, yes! We got the new idea! I am seven! You kill it! doing a good job! Weez is getting it! glasses that do me in with the screens. I think it's closed, baby. She knows where it comes from, though. <laughs> she does. She saw this and immediately, immediately said, I want some blue milk. Pretty much as soon as we stepped into the park, she said, I want blue milk. <laughs> Your girl knows where her snacks are. <laughs> But we're heading to do Tower of Terror now. We have our last ask for that. Oh, it was not a 30 minute wait, by the way. We literally just walked onto it. So don't always get deterred by the like wait times. It's usually lesser than it says it is because they'd rather overestimate than underestimate. But we literally just walked onto it. So yeah, walking through that too. For the last time this trip, Heading to no, we again. Yeah. Okay. okay, yeah, we're actually gonna go this way so that we don't go through Toy Story Land because we don't need them screaming for those because we don't have time to do all that. It is, what time is it? Park closes at nine, but we're just gonna do our dash for tower and then we're gonna go ahead and head out because like I said, we got an early day tomorrow, 7.30 a.m. early broke drop. <laughs> And they both need showers. We need showers. It's just so pretty. They do a really good job with like the details of everything. Like even down to the like concrete, which I'm not going to find any now. There you go. They've got like tracks in the concrete of like droid tracks and footprints and it's just really fun. It's snowing on sunset. Whoo, these kids. They were doing pretty well for a while there. That one, that old fashioned. Yeah. Apparently Sunshine Day Bar has a nasty old fashioned. Compared to Hollywood Brown Derby for sure. He said Hollywood Brown Derby the other day was like creme de la creme. Hey, uh-uh. Don't don't touch the rope, please. Are y'all gonna do the shower ride again? She said she likes it because it makes her hair fly up. I see them. Yeah, there's no one here to clean the house. I don't know, Bubba. There's more spider webs in here. Uh-huh. Look at that chandelier. You unlock this door with a 
key of imagination. Best in my experience. Are you ready, Weeze? You excited? Front left. Nope, this way. Buddy, walk. <laughs> but the video is going to get it. We have to do the press pennies, especially since she loves this ride so much. All right, here comes your penny. There's one. You get four, Bubba gets four. <laughs> Y'all, she loves this ride so much and it makes me so happy. <laughs> he said, oh my God, oh, she was still looking for her room because the whole like spiel is your room's not ready yet. You're, you know, we're taking you to your to your guest rooms at the hotel. So we got off and she said, where's our room? <laughs> Bye, Tower. Bye, Sunset. I feel like Winifred on Hocus Pocus. A uh, bye-bye. A uh, bye-bye, Sunset Boulevard. Cast members are just wooing everyone coming down. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> right, bye bye Hollywood. Until next time.